Good morning, friends. Today I'm going to read you B by Britta Teckentrump. Dawn is breaking on a brand new day, and in the meadow, poppies sway. A bee appears striped black and gold. A wonder of nature is about to unfold. In the treetops, birds start to sing. The little bee beats her wings. As she travels here and there, a gentle humming fills the air. Back and forth, to and fro, bee knows exactly where to go. Visiting flowers of every hue, she has a special job to do. Gathering nectar as she goes from every foxglove, every rose. Dusty with pollen, the little bee buzzes, buzzes busily. Bee travels on from bloom to bloom, drawn in by their sweet perfume. Harvesting flowers one by one, her compass is the midday sun. Among the orchard's apple trees, blossoms quiver in the breeze. Carrying pollen from place to place, bee always leaves a tiny trace. Flowers as far as the eye can see. Too many flowers for just one bee. All of a sudden, bee is gone. She has a message to pass on. Back at the hive, bee spreads the news. There's work to be done, no time to lose. Listen for their gentle humming. The word is out, the bees are coming. Buzzing over the dense hedgerows, past the pond where wild thyme grows. Through the orchard's sweet smelling scent, the bees travel on with calm intent. As lilies glow orange in the sun, the bees must finish what they've begun, stopping at every flower they find, leaving the gift of pollen behind. The peas the bees pass over a woodland stream. Droplets sparkle and pebbles gleam. Water trickles, bubbles, and weaves. A weeping willow trails its leaves. As the bees fly on through the buds and burrs, a tiny miracle occurs. So many plants and flowers you see were given life by one small bee. The end. Yay! Bye, friends.